I know Pat is the Kemi Mutombo man. Everybody can say whatever they want to say, but no one does it like Pat. No, 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 not today, not in mass. And welcome back, Pat from the Fantasy Basketball Show. Today we're going to be taking a look at some sleepers once more, players you might want to get a jump on right now for the fantasy playoffs. Before we start, let's get to our card of the day. So today we got a Kobe Bryant, Kevin Garnett, Jermaine O'Neal, rookie back from 1996. It's surprising that Garnett made only the second team looking back at his career, but he did come out of high school, the second player to do so after Moses Malone. So also before we start, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button with notifications on to keep getting these videos as soon as we post them. If you have any questions about your team, ask us in that comment section below. We'll answer every single one to help you win your championship. And now let's get into this video. So starting us off, we have Charles Bassey. Bassey in the last week is averaging 14 points, 7 rebounds, and 3 assists. On 78% shooting in the last two weeks, he's averaging 1.2 blocks, so very impressive in limited minutes. He's averaging only 20 minutes per game on the dot in the month of March, but Bassey's somebody I'm finding myself adding in a lot of teams right now, as there's a lot of potential here, and the Spurs could give him a lot of run, especially now as some injuries have come up and Pirtle is no longer with the team. So add him if you can, wouldn't be a bad addition, only 12% rostered in Yahoo Leagues. And then to Terrence Ross, so he's coming off a 24-point, 6 three-pointer, 2 steal, 62% game. In a limited sample, he's averaging 49% shooting this year. In previous years, though, he's closer to 42% for his career. Also had a number of years where he got over a steal per game, so something to monitor. He got 23 minutes in his last game, so maybe he'll start getting over the 20-minute mark now in the absence of Durant. So somebody to potentially acquire, only 4% rostered and has a great schedule for the upcoming week. Back-to-back -back nights starting Monday and Tuesday. It's surprising that he's doing so well with Okogi also doing well. So add him on your team. A bit of a speculative ad with a little bit of risk attached, but low risk, high ceiling here for Terrence Ross. So we'll see what happens. And next, Joe Ingles. So averaging 9 points, 4 rebounds, 3.5 assists, and 1 steal, and 2.3 three-pointers per game on 54% shooting in the last week. He too is only 4% rostered in Yahoo Leagues, but he's gotten 26 minutes in each of his last three games and posted a steal in each of his last four. So something to make note of right now. Ingles could potentially give you a potential boost all around. He's posted at least two three-pointers in five of his last six games. He's also had four three-pointers twice in his last six. So pretty good for a player, only 4% rostered. So that about does it for this one. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button with notifications on to keep getting these videos as soon as we post them. If you have any questions about your team, ask us below. We'll make sure to answer every one to help you win your championship. We'll see you next time. Not too much.